Alice Gear Aegis CS will be released outside of Japan on March 16th for PS4, PS5 and Nintendo Switch. However, it's just been announced that the game will have some changes on PS4 and PS5 compared to Switch. The title is a 3D battle arena game with visual novel elements and online multiplayer. Furthermore, an anime TV adaption will begin broadcasting in April 2023. Western publisher P-Cube discussed the changes over on Twitter on March 8th. The post reads, For Alice Gear Aegis CS, we have had some queries regarding differences between the releases on each platform. PlayStation versions will have the below differences, which can also be seen in the image and video previews. 1. Character Ray Azure Flash costume back netted patch. 2. Ace's costume removed from 6 characters. P-Cube then states, These are the only differences between consoles. The Nintendo version is unchanged. And we can assure that there are no differences in the visual novel scenes, characters themselves, or voice lines aside from from the above list. P-Cube has provided three clips to demonstrate the differences. These two clips compare the Azure Flash costume, which has the character's back covered up more on PlayStation. And the third clip from P-Cube shows the Ace's costume that has been removed from six of the game's characters. And again, the costume shows the character's backs. The game has been given a teen rating by the ESRB on both Switch and PlayStation and comparable ratings in other Western regions, meaning the changes will not be due to rating related reasons. P-Cube has not currently provided further information on why these changes have been made, however the alterations could be due to Sony's stricter content policies that were introduced in 2018. There are many reports of Sony's policy changes on the channel, such as this video taking a look at 26 games that have faced cuts on PlayStation. Although, the situation with Alice Gear Aegis CS is more unusual than most, as the game was released in Japan in September 2022, and the PlayStation versions were the same as the Switch release. Typically, these policies from Sony affect all versions released around the world. But there is another discrepancy between the West and Japan, and that is that the game is released for older audiences in Japan, with it being given a 17 plus age rating. It is perhaps a possibility that the higher age rating influenced the situation. But but without further details, all that can be done currently is to speculate. What are your thoughts on these changes? As always, let us know your thoughts in the comments below, and until next time, thank you for watching. Support Sensor Gamers work with a tip, and I'll read out and add your name to this clip. See the description for more info.